Right now, all new at 11, the reopening of South Beach moves forward after a tumultuous spring break that few would care to remember. Tonight, Miami Beach leaders relieve the spring break chaos is over. And with more people getting vaccinated, the county curfew being eliminated, and travel demand growing, there's a lot of new hope for better months ahead. CBS 4's Keith Jones has much more from the beach, all new at 11. Miami-Dade County Mayor plans to lift the curfew as of April 12th. Miami Beach, even despite its chaos and craziness that we've seen over spring break, plans to lift its curfew as well. Night falls and the scene of a quieter Miami Beach plays out. Fewer on the streets, fewer at restaurants, a far cry from two weeks ago. Recently, it's been kind of, you know, nonchalant, nonchalant. You know, everybody's been chilling, you know, nothing crazy. But I was here on spring break. They had to bring rubber bullets out. But there's renewed hope with Miami-Dade Mayor Daniela Levine Cava announcing a canceled curfew beginning April 12th. Municipalities still have the authority to supersede the mayor's order, like Miami Beach. But the beach is eager to get back to business. Our manager felt that we were close enough to the end of it where he could uh, provide some relief given the fact that there's still a midnight curfew. So it was, it's really supposed to end this weekend regardless. I think he felt like we were, you know, from what the police department was saying, is that we were in a much better place, obviously. And so moving forward, Mayor Dan Gelber says the entertainment district is back, still operating at 50%. Restaurants and bars are eager to extend those hours. I think we'll reopen the economy because the restaurants will work more hours, and it's like a benefit from all the tourists here. Visitors who saw the chaos of weeks ago heard the crush of crowds have slowed to a trickle. Tours from Venezuela took a chance to visit South Beach as a family destination. It's the first time, and let, let's, I, I hope that will be quiet. So, so it's been a nice experience? Yes. The curfew, short hours, and the pandemic have been catastrophic for some businesses like Gelato Go. Luigi Capolino saw a 75% reduction in business, but is starting to recuperate. Lifting the curfew offers a sense of relief. Finally, finally, because uh, believe me, till now, was a nice <laughs> He also operates an Italian restaurant and a hotel. Hotel management decided to use the pandemic to renovate, his restaurant included. For this reason, we prefer to take close for another couple of months, remodel everything, and then when we reopen, I think in the end, it's better for everybody. So this past spring break and the pandemic has certainly afforded Miami Beach and its administration a learning experience, one that can change the future. We're able to deal with the, these kinds of crowds. We're going to continue, I think, every year to assume that we have to do something about it. Uh, I, I think we probably should have acted earlier this year. Mayor Dan Gelber still has his vision of turning this entertainment district from the wild, crazy place that it can be sometimes into a residential, restaurant, retail, and an art district, one that's enticing to family destinations, not just for tourists, but for all of South Florida. In Miami Beach, Keith Jones, CBS 4 News tonight.